Okay, now let's create a new virtual machine on our Cosmos cluster. Okay, so the prerequisite is, is to have a new a ISO. Okay, so we are we already have an ISO in our cluster. Let me show you that. New ISO. Yeah. We have an ISO here, uh, Ubuntu ISO that has been already uh, uploaded in our environment. Okay, so let's create a new virtual machine right now. Okay, I will call it. Uh, um, how can I put this? This uh, is very simple. Okay, and uh, yeah, let's move. Let's go next. Up. And uh, the, the image, the image will be this one. Okay. Next step. And uh, um, everything in here is okay for me. Okay. The default settings and the storage. We would like to let to let it uh, located in the uh, VM store pool. Okay, let's let it let it let it all relocate it in the VM pool. Okay, so let's do that. Now, next step, uh, what we want to do is uh, to do things else. We would like uh, to, yeah, for me it's okay. Huh? Yeah, nothing, no big deal. For the size, I can increase it a little bit, but up to me, let me do that. Good. Next step. Uh, the calls let's go to two and uh, and uh, the machine cells. Yeah, for me, it's okay. Let's move to the, to the deployment regarding the, the bridge. You should be connected on the management bridge, that is okay for me. Okay, let's start with. Deployments. Okay, now the VM has been created. Now let's start it. I not not the, the, the creation is not yet completed. Okay. So now we will uh, complete all the installation. Okay, great. So let's start. Should we make sure for the uh, installation language? But for the keyboard, I will I choose the French because I have a French keyboard right now. And the next step. Done. Yeah, server. Okay, for me, we can the, the networks. I would like to configure it uh, manually. So let's specify uh, all the information. Turn, turn, and uh, zero, zero slash six. 
in and the address will be 10 10 that I will have to and uh, 200 yes that keeps yes and 160 but okay and the get way let's first we get way uh, zero for me and one and the name server for the use of the IP address of the gas company okay so for me it's okay and let's just perform a last checking whether everything is okay and uh, yeah okay for me it's okay so let's continue the save Uh, I'm done. Yeah, continue. Okay, I'm accepting the default customization of the drive. And uh, for this, okay, yeah, continue. And uh, your name, I will use uh, this name, which is my first name, this is the first name, my middle name, yeah. And um, server will be your, uh, hmm, let's call it, uh, let's keep it simple, yeah. And uh, pick a username. And the password. Great. Uh, yeah. And I have to choose other open uh, SSH. Okay. Let's choose it. Not done. Yeah. So the, the complete installation is ongoing. After the installation, the system will give you the hand to remove the ISO. Okay, so I will show you how to do that very easily. A piece of cake for this part. Now it's okay for me. Let's move to the root part. Now, what is asked is that we want the, the ISO, okay? So, so let's do that at the moment. Hardware, um, ISO, where are you? Yeah, I'm there. Yeah, so now let's move it simply. Are you sure you say yes? I'm sure. I want to I want to do it. So now from now I can say uh, enter. I can hit enter.
Okay, now as you can see, you go and the app, let's try to connect on it. Yeah, on it, and let's try to bring the Great, okay, so this is it, and uh, congratulations, you have. Uh, you have deployed your cluster visualization on your cluster. Okay, so thank you very much. I'll see you for the next lecture. Bye from now.